Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori, and I've got a Dollar Tree haul for you. And I'm wearing a shirt that I made. It says Vintage 1970. Uh, today is actually my birthday, so I wore this to work because it's cute. And in my crazy cat lady mug, I've got some David's Loose Tea. And this is called Organic Cream of Earl Grey. It comes in these little tins. So I have Earl Grey tea tonight. And I got some cute stuff. Not a lot, but fun stuff nonetheless. So I wanted to show you. Ooh, and some of it I need to use for a video that I'm doing. Hence, I need to show you. All right, so I picked up some tissue paper. They started giving the Christmas tissue paper in. I like this one. We have the snowflakes, just some red and green, and then some white that just says Merry Christmas. Um, and you get 16 sheets. That's not bad for a dollar. I use uh, tissue a lot in my wrapping, but also I buy it because when I put Christmas away, I use it to wrap my ornaments and I don't necessarily keep it from the year before. I mean, if it's in good shape, I will, but it's so cheap, but I have some good ornaments. So I like to wrap them in tissue. I picked up this basket. Um, it's not quite the size of a clothes basket, but it's definitely bigger than like a, a basket you would stick on a shelf or something. I'm using this for um, the advent calendar that I'm going to be putting together a video for you. Hence, I need to do this haul, so I have this for the advent calendar video. And at first I was going to hang this stuff, but you'll see when I do the video, some of the stuff is heavy. So I thought I'll just wrap it all up, fill this basket with the gift, the individual advents, and then she can just reach in and pull out one gift a day. And then she'll have this basket for whatever. So I grabbed one of these. I like it and I like that there's a handle. And I may weave some ribbon and make a bow or something just to make it festive. On the same line for the advent calendar, I picked up some gift wrap. Now I do not need gift wrap in my life because I have a ton. But I liked this retro teal. And this is a Hallmark gift wrap. It's Hallmark Expressions. It's 15 square feet, it's holographic. I just thought it would be adorable and retro in that basket. And it has snowman and Santa Claus and reindeer and little trees and it's just adorable and I thought she would appreciate that. So I grabbed that gift wrap to take care of her advent calendar and some tissue will probably get used with that as well. And then the other thing I picked up, which I thought this was a great idea and I have one of these somewhere but I can't find it. But it's a tape dispenser. It's a weighted tape dispenser. These are great for wrapping Christmas presents, especially if you have a lot to do because you just sit this down and you can just pull your tape and you're not like sticking it to your hand and blah, blah. So it's just an, let me pull it out because we're going to see if it works. I mean, it's a dollar. I don't have a high hope, but we're going to see how this works. Um, so you get this and like I said, it's pretty pretty good weight and it does come with the little dealy whoppy that goes in the middle I, there's a name I'm sure and then they also sell these six packs now there's not a ton of tape on here but for a dollar I'll get all my gifts wrapped so for two dollars worth of tape because I just feel like at Christmas time tape can be expensive all right so if you've never used one of these contraptions before this little doo whopper thingy goes in the center here, right? And then it sits in a little groove. Oops, I put it in backwards. Of course I did. So it just snaps down in there. And when you pull it, just gravity does it. Now I gotta loosen up this tape here. So give me a, oh, here it is. Not too bad. Okay. Sorry, well, it's stuck to my finger. Okay, tape dispenser. Oh, this is gonna work. And then you just do that and pull off your tape. Now, I know you can get this tape with much more tape on it. You can even put washi tape in here. I mean, is that crazy or what? Just stick washi on here, especially if you're using the same one for a lot of different projects. But for gift wrapping, and this will go in my gift wrapping basket, this is perfect. And for $2, yeah. 
Because even if I bought one more of these, it's still just a dollar. So that's perfect. I may actually just leave that up here because this is where I wrap presents. And again, I have an advent calendar due, so I needed that. Enough with the advent calendar. Okay. Now, I found at one of my stores these again, and I grabbed one more of each. Um, I showed these in a haul before. I love this, and this is what I do. This is the color scheme that I'm going to do for Christmas this year. I'm not hanging these on my tree, although I totally could. I'm going to be putting these in a basket of some sort, like laying them as filler. So I bought one of the round, or the, yeah, the, but it's flat and round. I got the bulb which I swear is wiffle balls. I can feel it and I'm telling you this is a wiffle ball in here. And then the star, I didn't care for the Christmas tree, um, but that's just me. But I love this print and it's going to match. And I think on my coffee table in a wooden bowl of some sort, I'm just gonna fill these ornaments. I love it with the green and I might get some real greenery to stick in there, but these, you know, that's a good price. And I'm going to tell you right now, this is $3.49 at Hobby Lobby every day. So I grabbed three of those. So that means I have six. And then I can do like a solid black, a solid red to mix in. So I grabbed three of those. I grabbed this really cute box for no other reason than A, look at it. It's adorable, the filigree. But in my Christmas card box, my pens and stuff were just kind of free floating. So what I'm going to put in here are, the, I use some rubber stamps. I can put my pens in here, my mailing stamps in here, um, and just keep these and everything together in that box. I will show you what my Christmas card box looks like when I pull it out. But I thought this is perfect to hold pens because I have like red, gold, silver, different kind of pens that I like to write with. My stamps and even like addresses from the year before, but just keep the loose things tidy in that. So I thought that was fabulous. At my $1 tree, they still had these with the 12 instead of the eight. So I picked up two. Um, yeah, I thought that would be perfect. I may end up using a couple of these for the advent, but we'll see. Um, I, I honestly have no need for these right this second, but I thought, Hey, these are the 12 packs, not the eight packs. So I grabbed two because I do use them. So I grabbed those. This silliness, I'm going to try this on Alex for no other reason that I think it'll be funny. Um, putting him in a harness. Let's see. And maybe that I could take him outside. I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to see if he'll even wear it. He is definitely an indoor cat. I don't let him free range outside. But I thought this would be interesting. So it's just with a dollar. It's a harness. It's for a small dog, but he's kind of fat. So yeah, he has a weight problem. <laughs> but so I grabbed a harness just to see what I can do with him. Um, we need some more tea. Mm, delicious. Okay, I picked up a package. And I already opened them because I want to show you what I'm doing with it. This is in the craft section, and these are resealable bags. At first, I thought they were like drug dealer bags, like tiny little bags, but they're not. They're folded in half when I took a better look at them. So they're this size, and they're sealable. This is perfect, and I'll show you what I'm using it for. Um, but you get 20, and it's perfect for like gift baskets if you have some loose things. So coming up, I have, um, we're doing a gingerbread decorating at my cousin's and uh, my little, my little junior cousin's going to have some friends and I'm putting together little goodie bags. And so what I'm doing for the goodie bags is I took those eye glow nail polishes and I separated them and they each got a nail file so far and a hair tie. So these little, they have other stuff too, but these are the loose things. And I thought this is perfect to put, um, yeah, just like tiny little, the little doodahs. I may get some more hair ties. We'll see. But I wanted these, and then I might put like a bow on it. I could tie it too, but I have some of those sticker bows I could just attach to that. And there's 20 in there, so that's perfect. I'm doing five gift bags. I can use more than one if I come up with other things. So I thought they would appreciate that. 
Um, I did pick up one more package of pens. I like these pens if you find them. And I was like, these are going to be gone. It's definitely part of their Christmas collection because you can see the like the stocking stuff or things that they put out. The red and white stripe says that that's part of their seasonal. And I liked these, so I wanted to grab one more package just to keep in my stash because I do write a lot and I like the silver and the white. That's really all I have to say about that. Um, I picked up one more mug, and I'm going to show you this mug um, for a gift. I know, but these are adorable, and it has the little um, camper on it, and I'm probably going to put some tea or hot chocolate and use this as a, not a mug cake mug, because I think this is too small for a mug cake, uh, but for like tea or coffee as part of my work gift thing that I'm putting together. I'm just grabbing little things as I see them and then I will have that video up. I'm also looking for things to match the people on my team that I think they would like. Opposed to last year's office video. Oh, my hair is itching. My last year's video that I did all kinds of punny things. This is going to be like geared towards the people on my team. So I love that mug. For that, I picked up some ibuprofen. If um, it's not the best deal, I'm going to tell you that. It's a dollar, and you get 30 tablets, but it works. Um, at Aldi, you get 100 tablets for $1.99. With my allergies, I'm just, like, eating Advil like crazy and Sudafed. Yeah. Uh, what else? Oh, just a couple more things. I found these. They're, like, wooden. It's like a gift tag. I am not hanging this on a tree either. I think this would be perfect in a three-tiered tray or some type of a basket or a display. This would actually look good, you know, tucked in the basket with my ornaments or something of that nature. Um, again, on a large gift, you could paint it. That is glitter. You could paint it and um, put to and from. But I just think I got two the different snowman. I just think these are adorable, and I'm going to definitely put them in some type of a tray or um, display. I'm not going to hang them on my tree. My Christmas tree, and I'll show you this year, is mostly like handmade ornaments or ornaments we picked up as a family traveling. I, you know, years ago, I gave up buying t-shirts and hats because they're just how many t-shirts do you need? And I started buying Christmas ornaments from the different places that I visited. So I have a lot of ornaments like that on my tree. Um, but this, I think these are big and I think they would look really cute or even tucked into a wreath. There's a lot of things you can do with these, but they're adorable. I found the red truck, um, what do they call this? Hot pot holders. Actually what I use it for probably is when I sit a pan down or to put on near my coffee station to absorb spills and stuff to be honest with you but it's adorable it'll just sit around in my kitchen I'm not gonna I don't use these as pot holders I mean I guess they're fine but I don't know I've never used them for that and they're not really the kind you can fold up I mean I guess I could and finagle it somehow but I'm just gonna use it them to sit around in my kitchen definitely um or i could use them as an end on my end table to put a coffee cup on you could do that yes they're a little big but if you're like me and i always have something to drink and it's always spilling <laughs> mm. but i loved it and this is all they had in the red truck the cashier basically told me she bought everything else so i was like oh okay and then the last thing i got I should have probably bought more of these, but I didn't. So adorable. It says, don't hurry, be happy. It's a sloth. Do you see the sloth? Please tell me. And then they had other ones too, but oh my geez, this is so cute. Um, I bought this for my purse for a very specific reason. And I will show you. This is my winter, goes in my winter purse. My fingers crack. I don't care how much lotion, how much gloves I put on my hands crack in the winter time so I put a kit together for my purse um this is called skin quick oh, liquid skin and they sell this at the Dollar Tree and I did use it last year so when you get a cut you can put this in the crack and it will help it 
heal faster. So I got some liquid skin to put in here from the Dollar Tree. Um, I got Band-Aids. And these are the Assured brand. I have the box over here. And these are the fabric ones, which I like. I think they stick the best. They're not cute, but they work. So I have Band-Aids because typically if I get a crack, I keep a Band-Aid on it because it hurts. And then I got this couponing this weekend, some Nivea cream pots. I have a couple of these and I'm gonna keep this in here too to keep moisturizing my hands. Um, let me show you, this stuff is thick. I think this is considered trial and travel in that section. Um, maybe I can get the lid off, maybe not. Yes, I can. It just smells like Nivea. It's a really thick cream but it works good. I've already tried it on my nails and it worked. Oh, that's why it's the, it's still touching the top. Um, so in this little bag for my purse, I have my thick cream and I'm going to look for a little pot of Vaseline because a lot of times if I put like a Vaseline on it and then the bandaid, it helps too. My quick skin, liquid skin, I want that on top glue. And then I'm looking for the little tiny, tiny pot of, um, Vaseline to stick in here as well and then I just keep this in my purse because quite frankly at any given moment my fingers will just start cracking and it's awful so I thought this is the perfect size to hold my little kit for my purse and then I will always have it with me and this is adorable so that's it that's all the things that I have purchased for this haul um, yeah, I'm not sure when this will keep going up. You'll probably see the advent calendar DIY maybe before this one. Maybe not. Um, depends when I put it together. But I hope you enjoyed and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.